What's up, YouTube? Y'all doing good? You good? You good? I'm good. You good? Okay, yeah. Well, um, this is the start of a new vlog. Um, I haven't did a vlog in a while. So, I figured I might as well start one because I haven't been vlogging. And I, even, I haven't even edited and uploaded my last vlog. So, hopefully I'll do that sometime today. But, um, yeah, it was time to start a new vlog. How y'all doing? You doing good? Okay. But, um, I just wanted to do this little quick intro. Um, I just ordered me. Well, I didn't just order. I ordered it, like, Friday night. I ordered me a vlogging camera. It's the Canon N. Um, I keep wanting to call it the Nikon N, but it's a Canon N. And it's not the best ca um, vlogging camera, but it'll do me for right now. And so, um, I got a good deal on it. It's refurbished through the Canon store. I bought it from the Canon store. And, um, I use eBay so I can get a percentage of it back. Um, because they do, like, cash back on websites. So I use eBay to get a little bit of money back. And so, yeah, it's not the best camera, like I said, but, um, it'll do me for right now. And really, the only thing I don't like about it is it uses, um... A micro SD card instead of a regular SD card, but that's all right. I just have to go and um, I seen an SD card at Walmart that I'll get today, and so I already have it for tomorrow if I remember to go get it. But um, I'm about to go to class in a little bit, and um, after I get out of class, I need to go to the store and get some peaches for the peach cobbler video that was supposed to be up like two, three weeks ago. But the first time I tried recording it for my cooking channel, the peaches were too ripe. The second time they were not ripe enough, and then I forgot what happened the other day because I just um, I recorded it the other day, and um, I forgot what went wrong, but anyway, if I don't get it right this time for the video, I'm going to move on to my next recipe because I'm spending too much time on this one recipe and I'll just move on to the next one and come back to it. But, um, yeah, I need to hurry up because I need to be in class in like 10 minutes. So, um, yeah, stay tuned. I just got back from class and, um, I went to Walmart. I got some peaches and some more stuff I needed to make my peach tablet for the video I'm going to do later. And I picked up a, I picked up a micro SD card, um, let me know, focus. I picked up a micro SD card for um my vlogging camera that's supposed to be here tomorrow. But okay, I knew I did wrong, okay. So I seen the eight gigabyte one and it was like nine eighty eight I believe. And then um I seen this sixteen gigabyte, it was eleven dollars and eighty eight cents, so I decided to just go with the big one and pay the extra two dollars. But the one I had before, because this isn't this isn't the first one I picked up. The one I had before it was a um sixteen gigabyte, but it was a class ten. And this one is a class four if this camera will focus. And it was a high performance one. And so this one, this is just like a regular size one. But, um, yeah, the one I had before, it was like a lightning strike right there. And it just said 6. And I was like, I don't want that one. I want mine to say 16. And so I went back and I got this one. And I should have just kept the other one I had because this one is only a class 4. And I need at least a class 10 because it's faster. So now I got to go back to Walmart and um, exchange this. <sighs> See, I should have just kept the one I had. Now I got to go back to Walmart. And they're working on the roads um, over here where I stayed. So they got like blocked off on both sides. So now I got to go back through that again and try to get back out. So, um, yeah, I guess I'll be back and then I'm going to eat me some and then I'm going to do the peach cobbler video. And because it's been a whole month since I posted my last video, I didn't mean for it to be that long. But I got so busy with school and work and uh, just trying to find the time to do it. But I got to start doing better on that. And so I got another recipe that I might be working on uh, tomorrow or maybe the day after. So, um, yeah, it'll be something different. But, uh, yeah, I guess you'll see that maybe. So, bye. That's it. Just stay tuned. It's cobbler time. Um, yeah, I'm about to get ready to make this peach cobbler. I'm about to get everything set up. Um, my nieces and my nephew um, are in the room with my mama back there. So, um, hopefully they'll keep it down. And so, um, yeah, I'm about to get started on this. And uh, get everything set up. And, uh, yeah, we're about to make some peach cobbler. Stay tuned. Alrighty. Got my peaches right here that I got from, just guess where I got them from, by the bag. And I uh, got some water. I'm about to get boiling over in here. You know, as soon as it comes up to a boil, I'm going to drop the peaches in there. And I'm going to let them boil for about 45 seconds. I'm I'm doing what they call a blanch technique. I've never did this before. But, like, if you boil the peaches for, like, 45 seconds. And then you um, drop them in ice water. Um, it'll have the skin come off them better. So, I'm going to try that. And, uh, yeah. That's it. Got the peach cobbler in the oven. Just cooking away. Doing its thing. Okay, so I got my peach cobbler going. I got that in the oven. Um, everything turned out good this time. I didn't have any problems. And uh, this time I got my peaches from Walmart. Um, my mom was vacuuming in the background, um, so that's what that noise is. But the last time I got the peaches, I got them from um, another store. The last piece I remember, I got from another store. This time I got them from Walmart. I got my, um, I took it back to Walmart. I got my other uh, micro SD card. See, the other one I got was, um, it was 1188. It was a 16 gigabyte, but it was a class four. 
and uh, I didn't I don't I didn't want a class four. I wanted a class ten, and so I was hoping that they were gonna be um I was hoping they were both gonna be the same price, but I should have known better. But um when I took it back I took it back to the woman. I told the woman I needed to do an exchange because I got the wrong um the wrong one, and instead of her just like doing the exchange, she just went ahead and gave me um a refund. She gave me my money back, which is what they do most of the time, and um. Yeah, so she gave me back, and when I, I went and found this one, I got this one, and uh, I actually didn't see any of these, the 16 gigabyte in the class, and I didn't see a spot for them um, on the shelf, so I was just assuming that they were the same price as the one that I got the last time, and I took it to one of those little price cannon uh, things that they have around Walmart, and uh, they used to have them things all over the store. At my Walmart, like, the only place, the two places I've seen them is one over there by the baby food stuff, and then there's another one by, like, the fishing equipment and stuff. But they used to have them things, like every time you turn around, you see one. But anyway, I tried to scan it before I went to the register. And when I scanned it, like I guess I guess it like rebooted or something like that. It made a noise and then all these numbers and letters popped up on the screen. So I was like, I'll just take it to the register. So I had a surprise. Like I just knew it was going to be $12.95. I had my $12.95 that um, the woman gave me back at the customer service desk. So I just knew it was going to be $12.95. And then it rang up $14.88. And it was like $16 something. But um, it's all right then. It's all right. I have um, 16 gigabytes now which is the same amount I have on my uh, SLR that I'm recording this with. So now I can record just as much on my vlogging camera as I can on this camera. So I'm about to go ahead. I think I'm going to start editing my last vlog and then I'm going to get this peach cobble stuff done. And then I might do some homework. So uh, we'll see about that. I might just chill. So uh, see you soon. I had planned on um, editing another vlog um, tonight, but I don't know why my computer's acting really slow. Uh, I'm actually converting all the files for um, that vlog into smaller format so I can edit with the smaller ones because I do something called proxy editing which is like you convert the files into a smaller format and then you edit with the small video files and then you trick those software system by switching out the files but I don't know why my computer is taking so long to do this it's been going for two hours now and it's not even halfway done well I, it's almost halfway but still it's taking so long I don't know why but anyway probably because my uh, computer is low on memory but, uh, yeah, I'm about to just put this over to the side, and then I'll just try to do it sometime tomorrow. So, yeah. Okay, so here's the final product right here. This is the peach cobbler. It tastes so good. And, um, hopefully, focus on me. Hopefully by, um, time that this vlog that you're watching right now is, um, Hopefully by the time that this vlog that you're watching right now, I should already have um, the recipe uploaded to my cooking channel. So I will leave the link down in the description box. And so you can watch that. And um, yeah, I think I'm about to go to bed in a little bit. It's actually kind of late right now. So um, I'm just having a little midnight sweet snack. You know, you know how that is. But uh, yeah, I think that's it for now. And um, I will see you tomorrow. I'm so happy to get my camera. I'm so excited to get my camera tomorrow. Um, I finally have an actual vlogging camera that um, I can use. Instead of holding my phone, which I can't, is really pretty much useful because, I mean, useless because I don't have that much space on it. And uh, this other camera is just too big. I have to keep switching hands if you haven't noticed. But, uh, yeah, that's it for right now, and I will see you tomorrow. What's up? It's the next day. It's Wednesday the 17th, and I just got up a little bit early ago. And um, I decided not to go to my um, computer class today. Um, it's just a computer class. I can do the work at home. But I had a bunch of other stuff I had to do, so I just decided not to go to um, that class today. And um, also... My camera is supposed to be coming in today, and so I don't want to miss that shipment. Even though um, I have to be at work at 1 o'clock, I'll probably miss it anyway. But still, I just decided not to do it because, you know, then they have to wait and bring it the next day. And then I probably won't be here tomorrow. And my mama, she wasn't here to pick it up today either. You know, if she wasn't able to stay here today either. So, um, yeah, I just decided to um, wait on it. Hopefully, to get here before it's time for me to go to work. But, um... I'm about to go take me a shower, then I'm going to fix me something to eat, and then um, I'm going to get started on the instructional part of my um, peach cobbler video, so I can go ahead and get that done with, and I can start editing it. But um, I wanted to do it yesterday, but of course, the way my life works, nothing ever goes planned. But uh, yeah, that's about it for right now, and uh, I'll see you in a minute. I hope the FedEx man doesn't come while I'm in the shower. Oh, and the other day, I bought me some of this um, Irish Spring signature for me, and this stuff smells so good right here. Um, I wanted to try it, and I finally decided to go get me some. And um, this is kind of this kind I usually use right here. This is the Suave uh, Professionals for Men. It's three in one. Uh, this is three in one too. It's uh, face, body, and hair wash. And then this is like shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. So yeah, this kind I usually get. I usually get this from um, the dollar store. Uh, they have it for three dollars. And this is uh, it's twenty eight ounces, and this is only fifteen ounces right here. So this is almost um, double the size of the Irish Spring. 
But this stuff, it smells so good right here. And um, this stuff was $3.97 at Walmart. And my stuff that I get from the dollar store was only $3. But uh, yeah, it smells so good though. And I will happily pay the extra $0.97 cents plus tax to get this stuff. Because this stuff smells really good. And plus you can wash your face with it too. It just felt like it came straight from Ireland. Smells like it comes straight from Ireland. Yes, um, I'm sorry about the accent. I really don't. I'm sorry if I have offended anyone. Don't, don't, don't get me, okay? I'm sorry. All right, I, I apologize, okay? But uh, yeah, let me go ahead and take my shower. Y'all not gonna, y'all not gonna see me in the shower. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but you can't, you just can't, you can't see me. Sorry. <laughs> All right, I'll be back. Some biscuits. I'm about to make me some biscuits and gravy. Um, yeah, because uh, I want it for breakfast, even though it's um. It's actually lunchtime right now, but I still wanted it. So I'm about to make me some biscuits and gravy. And um, I'm cheating today and using uh, uh, packaged gravy because I didn't feel like fooling with all the butter and the roux and all. Anyway, I'm just using packaged gravy. So I'm about to get that going. I'm only cooking four of these. The rest of them are going in the freezer. And another thing I, I don't like about using my um, phone to uh, vlog is like when I use the front facing camera, like depending on which way you hold it, sometimes the clips like they record upside down and then it doesn't like it doesn't fix it in the phone. So I, when I am editing it, I have to go back and fix it. It's not that big of a deal. Like I can fix it in like two, um, two clicks, but still that's one step that I wouldn't have to do. Wait a minute, I'm, wait a minute, zoom back in. Anyway, that's one step that I wouldn't have to do. But um, hopefully when I get my new vlogging camera, I'll remember to keep it with me all the time and I won't have to use my phone anymore. So, uh, but I'm sure I'm going to get it sometimes. So I'm about to um, get ready to do this video, this um, peach cobble instructional part of my video. But um, yeah, uh, I figured since this video was supposed to be shot yesterday, I might as well wear the same shirt I had on yesterday. So um, I'm going to have to go ahead and do that real quick. It's 12 before I got to be at work at 1 o'clock, so I need to hurry and try to finish this. And uh, I don't think my camera's, and my camera's not going to be here before I go to work. I already know it. And so, um, yeah, I, see see how my life works out? See, because I have to work, I'm working a, a short shift today. I have to work 1 to 6. Usually, it's 2 to 7, but today is 1 to 6. See, because, you know, if I had to go at 2, that would be like almost a whole entire hour that I could be here um, waiting on my camera. But uh, see, see how nothing in my life ever works out? But I guess it'll be all right. Maybe I'll uh, be able to bring it back tomorrow. But, um, yeah, maybe, maybe you know, while I'm walking out to my car to go, maybe the FedEx man will pull up then. But, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do this video and uh, get this done with. So, uh, yeah. Got everything all set up over here. Just my tripod is patiently waiting on my camera. So, let's go ahead and let's get started. I'm about to, um, I'm taking my little 15 minute break from lunch, and I'm, I mean, from work. And I'm about to go and, uh, I'm about to run home real quick because I seen that my camera was um, delivered, so I'm about to go get that real quick because I don't want it sitting out in the in the um, in front of the door. So yeah, I'm about to rush home, rush and go get that real quick. All right, back to work I go. It's so hot outside, I'm all sweating and stuff. But uh, yeah, I'm about to go back to work and um, then I'm gonna check the camera out when I come back. Okay, I'm back from work. I'm so hot, like it's been so hot lately, and I'm all sweaty and stuff. But um, I j just got back from work. Um, I really didn't see the point, and then, you know, he let me go kind of late for my break, like, um, I went to, on my break at 5.15, and I, then I got off at, um, my break was from 5.15 to 5.30, and then I got off at 6 o'clock, so I just think he should let me go on my break a little bit earlier, but anyway, um, I'm about to get this camera set up, and then I'm gonna take me a shower and eat me, some, eat me something real quick, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get this camera set up, and, uh, I'm not liking the way the video looks on the LCD screen, which I know that's really not doing it justice on the screen. So hopefully it looks different once um, I upload it to my computer and stuff. But yeah, I'm about to get the um, micro SD card put in and I'm going to get it all set up and all that kind of good stuff. So uh, yeah, and then I'm going to do some test footage on it. So you might see that after this clip. It's asking me what time zone I'm in and like none of these look right. I think it's Chicago though. So let's find Chicago. Yeah, if it's not right, it don't matter anyway, so. I'm gonna go with Chicago, okay. 
It's not 725, it's 625. Ugh. So this is me. Do I look good? Do I look good? Um, it's actually a little bit lighter than I thought it was gonna be. Um, I mean, it's a little bit heavier than I thought it was gonna be. But it's a lot lighter than this big old thing right here that I've been using to do some of my vlogging. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I think I'm, I was I was a little worried about it. I thought, I thought I was going to take it back, but um, I'm feeling a little good about it right now. So, uh, yeah, let's 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 do some more testing with this. My phone says I have a missed call from 007. Um, that's some Mission Impossible stuff right there. I don't know nothing about that. So y'all leave me alone. You got the wrong number. Here's my old camera. Um, it's a Fujifilm Finepix AV100 A something. It's A one something women with it. It's AV100, I believe. And um, yeah, it was a pretty nice camera. It took some uh, pretty good pictures, and uh, it it recorded in 720p. And so I got this, ooh, maybe four years ago, three four years ago. And uh, yeah, it was an okay camera. But the only thing I didn't like about it. But um, I really wasn't too concerned with it back then. Is that um, it couldn't like focus while video recording. So um, I would have to like focus on something and then record it. And if I wanted to focus on something else, I would have to stop recording. But uh, yeah, like I said, I got this like maybe four years ago, maybe longer than that. And another thing that I didn't like about it is it uses it used regular batteries. So um, you can charge you just to use regular batteries. I, I always said when I had it that I was gonna get um, rechargeable. But actually, I did have some rechargeable batteries, but um, I lost the charger that go to it. But, uh, yeah, that's my old camera right here. And it just stopped working on me. I don't know what happened because I could have been using this until I was able to get, like, a better camera than what I'm using now. Not saying that this is a bad camera, but, um, yeah, I'm, I'm sure this it, there, it could have been a better camera that I could have got. But, anyway, it just, like, I put new I put new batteries in it. Those batteries were new. And I put them in there, and I would turn it on, and uh, it would just immediately, the lens would come out. It, the screen would show up and then it would just immediately go off. So I don't know what happened. So I guess I'm about to get ready to throw this one away since I have another camera. Now I'm just waiting until I got another camera to throw this one away. So I'm about to drop this down right now while I'm holding it like that. But yeah, it's the Fujifilm Fine Pix AV100. I like it. It was good while it lasted. So yeah. Okay, so I'm now recording with the um, Canon N. And this is what I look like in a low light situation. I think this is even lower. I can't. I can't tell. But anyway, look at me. I don't look too. It's not too bad in low light. Um. Oh, and this is really dark. But yeah, this is what I look like now. Yeah, I need to. Let me put this shot on. Uh, yeah. This is what I look like. What's up? What's up? I gotta get used to trying to hold this and try to vlog with it. And it's. Let's see. Focus. Oh wait, it's already in focus. Let's see. Let's focus on the toothpaste. It's pretty quick with um focusing and stuff like that. So yeah, um I gotta get used to it. Something to get used to, but uh yeah. It's real nice and different. It's real nice and different. That's what I like about it. So um yeah, I'm gonna let it finish up charging and then uh I'm gonna use it some more. I might go outside with it real quick just to see what it looks like outside. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. So let's go outside real quick. This is what I look like outside. So yeah, this is what I look like outside. Uh, I'm going back in now, this is awkward. My love with food box came in today. I knew it was gonna come in today, but I was so excited about this camera that I'm using, which I need to stop using and let it charge. But yeah, I was so um, excited about the camera that was coming um, that I haven't even, uh, I forgot about this, but yeah, it came in the mail, so I'm gonna do the video for it tomorrow, and I might record it using this to give my um, Night Gundy during 100 a little break. So yeah, and I haven't even—I just realized I haven't even taken a picture with this camera yet. If I've been using it all for videos, so um, I might just take one real quick. So uh, yeah, what's going on, people? It's the next day. It's Thursday, May the 18th. Um, I'm about to get ready for school, and then later on I got work. But when I come back, I'm going to do my um my love with food box uh, video for this month. But yeah, I'm gonna do that when I get back. And then um, I need to fix me something to eat, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for school. I have to see what the footage looks like um, once I upload it to the computer, because right now I'm really not a fan of it. Um, just looking at it on the display that's on the camera. But uh, I'm gonna upload some of this footage um, onto my uh, computer, and then I'm gonna upload it to YouTube to see what it looks like on there. Because right now, I'm not too um, satisfied with it. So um, we'll see. Everything turns out. 
right now I'm on my way to class. I have to leave a little bit earlier because they're still working on the roads. So I have to make sure I get to class on time because I can't be being late and I need a haircut too. I'm gonna get one tomorrow. So, let go to school. Look at this. I'll be so glad when they get done. Deal with it, can't deal with it. I'll never understand why some people when there's like good parking spots available in the school parking lot, they still park all the way back in the back. Maybe I'm just lazy like that. But uh, that's me. I just got out of class and uh, I'm about to go get me something to eat right now because I'm super hungry. I don't know why I'm gonna get something to eat at though. Let me think for a second. Okay, so I decided to go to Captain E's for lunch today. But um, yesterday this woman made me mad at work. Like um, I went outside to get some buggies because uh, we were low on them and uh, none of the stalkers, I guess they were um, in the back door somewhere. Anyway, I went out to get some buggies and when I was walking out of the door, there was four people just standing in the door, in the way. It was three women and, and a man. Um, one of the women, she was with the man, they were a couple. And so I said, excuse me, and they moved out of the way. But first of all, why are you standing in the door in the first place? Like that's, that's you in the way, get out the way. And so after I came out and I, brought, I was bringing some of the buggies back in, they were still there in the door. And I asked one of the women, um, it was an older lady. I asked, I said, excuse me. I was nice, being nice like I always am. And then she was like, uh, you trying to rush me. Don't you see grown folks is talking? Uh, don't you see I'm trying to work? That, that, that pissed me off. Like she said it like she was playing, but I could tell she was serious with it too. And then it was hot too and you got me out here waiting. I ain't got time for that. But um, I'm about to go get my, I'm waiting on my food right now. And so I'm about to go home and um, I'm going to refilm my uh, video that I did yesterday because my shirt had a stain on it and uh, that was just bothering me. So I gotta redo that and then um, hopefully that vlog should be done and so I can go ahead and get that uploaded for this channel. And so, yeah. I finally got the shoes that I wanted. So um, I was going to order them when I got paid last week and so I went to Foot Locker because Foot Locker was the only place that I thought had them. And so I went to Foot Locker and once I got onto their website, um, I went in there, I chose my size, which is a size, th a size 13, and so I went through the whole process, I checked out, and right before it was time for me to start adding my um, credit card, my debit card information and everything, um, they tell me that um, the product was out of stock and it's no longer available. Like, that made me so mad, because like, come on, I know y'all got to have a good team behind y'all, so y'all should know better. I mean, it should be posted as you have it in stock, and then once I add it to my cart, it's not available anymore. That made me really mad. So last night I was just trying to find me another pair of shoes that I wanted, uh, which was uh, pretty tough because I actually I didn't find it. I seen one pair that I liked, but I wasn't too crazy about it. So anyway, I came across this one website, which I never heard about it before, but apparently they're um, kind of popular. It's called um, footaction.com. They sell like, um, basically it's like Finish Line and East Bay. They sell like um, shoes and, and like sports stuff and shirts and stuff like that, like sports equipment. And so yeah, well, they, I know they. I'm, I'm not gonna say they sell sports cleavings, but I know they sell shoes, and I seen some shirts on their website. But they had the shoes that I wanted. The shoes that I'm talking about are the Nike Fly Stepper 2K3, and I wanted the um, white, gray, and I wanted the white, black, and wolf gray color. That's the one I had. They had a few other colors, but I wanted the white, black, and um, wolf gray color. So they had those, and they had them in my size, and so um, I went ahead and I ordered them today, and um, I used uh, Ebates. Which is, um, if you don't know what that is, it's like a website where you get cash back off of um, your online purchases. So you just go to their website and um, they have like a bunch of, they don't, they don't have every store on there, but they have a bunch of different stores that you can shop at. And you, what you do is you go to their website and you click the store from their um, website and then you go and you do your shopping and then they give you cash back. And uh, they had 5% cash back for um, shoe action. And also, um, when I ordered my camera from Canon, uh, when I ordered this camera that I'm vlogging with now, um, I used it for them too. And that was almost a week ago. It was a week ago because I ordered it last Friday. Um, I ordered it from them and I still haven't got my cash back. So I don't know. Well, it depends on like the store. Some stores, it might take five to six days. And then I know it said like on the other stores, it'll take um, up to 30 days because some uh, times you don't get the cash back until the return period is over. So maybe that's why I haven't got the cash back yet. So yeah, if you want to learn more about Ebates, I will have a link down in the description unless I forget about it. So you can sign up under my link and uh, I'll get a little... I'll get a little something something, you know, for, for telling you about it, I'll get a little bit something something. So, oh, and also when you sign up for the gift card, you'll get a, I mean, a, when you sign up for the website, they have like offers where you get um gift card, and I think it's, you get the gift card after you fix in your first, I want to say $25 or maybe, I don't, I don't know, it's, 20, it's between $25 and $100, I know that. So, uh, yeah, you get a gift card, a $10, a $10 gift card, 
Uh, they had uh, Walmart, Walmart, Target, and like two other ones that you can uh, pick from. I chose the Walmart one. So um, yeah, if you want to learn more about that, hopefully I remember to put a link down in the, my my link down in the description. So if because if I refer somebody, then I get like a gift card or something like that. Anyway. That's all I have to say. I'm so glad I finally got my shoes now. So I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right here. I'm happy I got my shoes. I always get what I want. Because I, I just, something told me to just keep looking last night. Keep on looking. And I found this website and I got my shoes. So I'm so happy I got my shoes. And so that's all I have for this vlog. I will see you on the next vlog. So thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe. So thank you so much. And I'll see you next time.